cloudy, dull and damp to start, but brightening up as we head through the day and the outlook is finally drier. I'll have all the details of that and more coming up on Good Morning Britain. Wednesday. Eventually, we Some are hope. getting there. Drizzle will clear, sunshine for the next few days. Finally, today, there are no weather warnings in force. And actually, today, a bit damp and drizzly through some eastern areas, but then skies brighten from the west, and the outlook for the next few days is drier than it's been for many of us. So this is the very latest satellite and radar. Still cloudy skies for eastern areas of England, the legacy of the weather front that brought a lot of rain. Yes. <laughs> Wow, that was a geography test there. West of, West of Belfast was that one. Now, weather-wise today, we have no weather warnings in force for the first time in a long time. And low pressure is now set to clear away, and that means high pressure will dominate. And high pressure brings more settled weather conditions, it brings light winds, it brings blue skies. And with bluer skies, it means that we have chillier nights to come, but temperatures by day are sitting around about average. So, this is the low pressure that brought the rain yesterday clearing away. And here comes our high pressure for the rest of the working week, at least behind me, weather front set to move in from the Atlantic, bringing rain into the weekend. But for today, it's drier and brighter for many of us compared to recent days, but still some outbreaks of rain and showers across the south and east. The radar picks out the wettest conditions through eastern areas of England, outbreaks of rain here. And then as we head through the day, showers. The winds feed in from the North Sea, so we see showers for East Anglia, the East Midlands, London, down towards Kent, but away from here it is largely fine and dry. So across the north of Scotland and across the Northern Ireland, sunny spells and light winds. For Wales in the southwest of England, perhaps a little more cloud and temperature-wise 13 to 18, pretty much average, but I think feeling more pleasant than recent days because finally the return of some sunshine. So is it here to stay? Let's take a look at our seven-day outlook. And we split the country in half. This makes it much easier for me, north and south. North is anywhere pretty much north of Leeds. So we look at our temperatures compared to average, the middle line here, setting around about where this should be for this time in October. Percentage chance of rainfall across the north. It is largely fine and dry for the rest of the working week, but just in time for the weekend, it turns more unsettled with showers and then rain. Fortunes further south of England and Wales as we head through the next seven days, again, looking at our temperatures compared to where they should be, giving us a trend, and it's sitting around about average, hints of it being a little bit milder into next week. But percentage chance of rainfall, a little hit and miss with the rain and drizzle in the east, fine and dry for the next few days, but then showers dominate through the weekend and for the start of next week.